good morning. It is Thursday, the 20 something else of April. It's cold today, it is six degrees, um, and it's certainly not Chile and t shirt weather. Um, certainly Chile, but not t shirt, but uh, you know. Um, I had a really good meeting with the Samantha Sykes guys yesterday, the trustees, did a bit of training, teach them how to upload and maintain the site themselves. Um, and it gave, me an, it gave me an idea about setting up a Pickled Spider, my design side, a Pickled Spider um, YouTube channel to do really basic maintenance on your website. Um, I get asked a lot of questions. A lot of my clients don't upload and don't update their websites once it's done and that's a shame really because it's a really simple tool and I thought about doing some quick one or two one minute videos like no more than one minute um, videos to to show them how to log in to the WordPress to update a post or use the CMS add images amend text etc etc so I think that might be a, a worthy a worthy thing to do and it really wouldn't take any time and I can do it from anywhere really I think you know, unless I'm charging the car, I'm going to look a bit weird talking to the screen in the middle of, you know, Costa Coffee. So, as I said, it's Thursday. Mia is on her way back from her holiday. I got told this morning. Um, and she's going to go to school tomorrow morning. And I'll pick her up tomorrow. So... I'm really looking forward to seeing her. I've missed her quite a lot, actually, the little little munchkin. Um, I'm now on route to a place for, called Kelfield in North Yorkshire on a little secret mission. And here's the downside of having an electric car, right? It is now 10 to 2. My meeting is at half past 3. But enable for me to be able to get back, I need to go charge, which takes roughly half an hour, 40 minutes. So your day has to be planned around how long it charges, how long the charge takes, and you know how long your travel distances and how you're going to get home and how you know. So it is now, like I say, 10 to 2. My high meeting is at half past three. I'll get to the charge station at probably in 10 minutes. It'll take 40 minutes to charge and then make sure I don't get squashed by this snowbar truck. And then it's half an hour. Yeah, it's a big truck. Um, it's half an hour from there, north. And then I've got to come back and do it all in reverse. But the great thing about the laptop, and that's one of the main reasons why I spent the time trying to get the laptop working, is so that I could actually just do some work at the service station. It's not a problem anymore. And I really enjoy it, because I can go there, I can buy a juice, and I've stopped buying the coffees now. I'm not buying the coffees, I'm not doing the mocha soyas or whatever I was getting before. I am sticking to fresh juices only because a it's costing a lot of money and b if it is costing me a lot of money i would rather put juice in myself than you know than all that sugar and chocolate and coffee and crap so that's what i'm doing now i'm very conscious about what i'm putting in i've eaten like i've eaten crap this last week and i've been such a slob i've been such a slob this last week it's been absolutely shit Sorry for swearing. I've woken up late, I've stayed up late, and it's all because I want to make sure that I get into a habit of putting in these YouTube videos. Um, and I want to make sure that I'm consistent, upload every day, just to see if I could do it and what, what a toll it will take on me. Um, and the byproduct of that is the fact that I don't start editing till 11 o'clock at night which I need to curb, I need to bring it back so that I'm editing earlier or edit through the day um, I don't know, but through the day I need to work so, you know, and that's another thing 
this week is one of those weeks where I felt like I've done absolutely nothing. I don't feel like I've been productive at all. But yet, you know, I'm doing what I love doing. So am I supposed to feel like I've achieved something? Am I supposed to have battle wounds? I don't know. I love what I'm doing. So it almost feels like I'm not doing it at all. But we'll see. Hey, the money's still coming in, which means I'm doing something right, I suppose. It's uh, not a lot of money, mind you. <sighs> I've just uh, finished at the charge station and I got in the car and I've smashed my thumb. Can you see that? I've pulled my flipping skin all the way, the nail all the way back. And I was just about to have like a really nice conversation about how lovely my car was and I loved it. And I just get in and I catch my bloody thumb and it hurts like mad. And now I've got exactly um, 23 minutes to do a 28 minute journey. So meeting over, God damn it, it's cold. Now I'm gonna, uh, I've stopped at a little place called Mrs. B's Lakeside Kitchen just to have a coffee and do a bit more work. Scuppered. Plans scuppered. Apparently this place, Mrs. B's Lakeside Kitchen, is not open through the week. It's only open Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So, so much for my uh, my little cheeky, cheeky cake and coffee break. Now it's back to civilization. I think I'll go the scenic route. This is where the Tour de Yorkshire is tomorrow along this road. All this area tomorrow, all through this area, will be absolutely cram packed for the people, you know, watching the skinny mechanical horses go round and round and round. I'm not going the right way, I've just turned and gone. Um, so yeah, it's, uh, I can't quite tell you what I'm doing at the moment, uh, what this meeting was about, but um, needless to say, it's very exciting. And uh, it's quite beautiful out here. Have a look. It's very flat, very farmy. I'm very driving, I'm supposed to be driving. I shouldn't be driving whilst on the camera. So, okay. Uh, I'll talk to you later. Yeah, I told you I really love this car. I really, really, really love this car. The astute ones of you will notice that this may be the next day because of the change of clothes, etc. Last night ended up being a bit of a washout. The weather was terrible. Um, I ended up staying at Helen up at the village. And now I'm doing a hasty retreat before the tour de Yorkshire comes through. It goes all the roads that were close soon and it comes right through the middle of here and it goes pretty much straight along the route that I need to do to get to the, the charge station to get home. So, yeah, I, I noticed that uh, my hits or my views on my my last one about the e-liquids uh, has fallen off the charts um, and that will probably be down to the fact that it was a 15 minute video and I do apologize I've done two like sort of 40 50 minute videos in a row and um, I really don't intend to do any more like that I'm, I am sorry um, so today I will be at home, I'll get the flat ready, I'm picking Mira up from school, she's back from holiday, she went to school today, and I will, um, or nursery even, and I will um, more than likely try and pick up, um, doing vlogs over the, when I've got Mia is pretty difficult, so I will endeavour to, uh, I will endeavour to do a vlog over the over the weekend and see what we're all up to. So that's it. Stay safe and don't forget to love each other. Cheers. Advances of thunder.